Okay, let's have number two. A rectangle has a length of 10 units and a width of 8 units. Squares of x by x units are cut out of each corner. And then the sides are folded up to create, are folded up to create an open box. If the volume of the box is to be 50 cm cube, what should be the length of the side of the square to be cut out? Okay, analyze that then. Volume will let you involved. And then you have a rectangle. Tatanggalan mo na mga corners square corners and then it if you fold mo yung mga natirang para mga flaps yun and then you will form an open box the volume of the box should be 50 ang tanong gaano daw kalaki yung ikakat mo so let's try to figure out i drawing muna natin so you have a paper you have a rectangle hindi to rectangle pero pwede na din yan and then you will cut out square corners of side x by x lagay lang natin dun. This is x, this is x also, ito x then, ito x then, and lahat ng sides x lang. And then, um, so we will have this one, and then we will fold the flaps, or we will we will fold the sides to create a box. Something that look like this one. And the volume now is 50 cm cubed. So what should be the length of the box to be cut out? Okay, let's analyze. We have a rectangle of 10 units by 8 units. Say for example, this is the 10 units, and this is the 8 units. Okay. Ngayon, kapag nag-cut ka ng square, squares of side of size x by x sa corners, ito, gano'n nakahaba to? From here up to here. Let me zoom that in. Okay, ibig sabihin, from this point up to this point, to, that is x, that is 10, tapos ma-minusan mo ng dalawang x. So this is 10 minus 2x. That corresponds to this length, tama ba? corresponds to this length. So therefore, this is 10 minus 2x. Now, how about the width? So ito, this one, remember this is 8. The whole thing is 8. Okay, remember that this is 8. From this one up to this one, that's 8 units. It's 8, kasi 8 din to, diba? 8. At kaso, nabawasan siya ng x at saka x dito. So, ang tanong, ganun lang kahaba ito. Which actually corresponds to this one. It's equivalent to 8 minus 2x. So, therefore, this side over here is x minus 2x. And obviously, the height, the height, ito yun. So, parang ito yun. The height is x. Now, let's compute the volume of the open box. Volume of... The volume of the box is equivalent to the product of all the measurements of the, or the, the product of the dimensions. So it's equivalent to x, that's the height, times 10 minus 2x, that's the length, times x, what's that? x, that's 8, should be 8, sorry, it should be 8 minus 2x. Why x? That should be 8 minus 2x, sorry, that should be 8 minus 2x. So this is 8 minus 2x. And then, all we have to do is to simplify this. Haba? Sabi sa problem, this is equivalent to 50 cm cube. Pero mamaya natin siya isulat. So katulad ng ginawa kanina, you can simplify this or you can expand this. Pero pwede natin itong gawin kay GeoGebra. All we have to do is to copy this. Let's consult GeoGebra. All you have to do is to paste that. Type nyo lang yung gusto nyong i-expand. And then you have to click this. Expand brackets. That's equivalent to 4x cubed minus 36x squared plus 80x. That is 4x cubed minus 36x squared plus 80x. And this is equivalent to 50. Okay? And then, let's simplify. Lahat, dali natin lahat sa left side. We have 4x cubed minus 36x squared. Pala, kinapi ko na lang. Plus 80x minus 50 is equal to 0. Katulad din yung kanina, all we have to do is to compute for the value of x that will satisfy this equation. And, for this case, let's use GeoGebra again. Paste nyo lang dyan. And then, let's click here, solve. Okay, so we have three values of x. We have x equals 1.2, x equals 1.6, and x equals 6.02. Let's copy this. So the values of x are this one. Okay, daming decimal places now. Bossa natin. It will be 11.2, and this one is 86.02. Okay, now, sino lang dyan ang pwede? So we were able to solve three. We have x equals 1.12, x equals 1.86, and x equals 6.02. But actually, yung isa dyan hindi pwede. Sino sa tingin nyo dyan ang hindi pwede? 
Lahat naman sila positive, no? So, lahat sila pwede. Pasok sila dun sa category na pagiging positive. Pero yung isa dyan, hindi pwede. At ang hindi pwede dyan ay C, 6.02. Bakit? Okay. Tingnan nyo to. If you have 10, 10 minus 2x, imagine multiply 6.02 by 2. That's 12 point something. I-subtract nyo sa 10. That will be negative 2. So, magne-negative na tong value na to. Yung 10 minus 2x. As well as, 8 minus 2x will also become negative, a negative length. So, hindi siya pwede. So, in this case, hindi pwede cx equals 6.2. So, we have x equals 1.12 and x equals 1.6. You can verify whether x equals 50 nga yung magiging volume. So, again, let's verify. So, if x is approximately, approximately ha. So, if x is approximately 1.12, Let's find the volume of the box. Let's see whether this is 50. Let's substitute. We have 1.2. Okay, let's get again GeoGebra. Okay, so that's 51.07. Labes. I sorry, hindi pala 1.2. It should be 1.12. Okay, let's copy this and let's paste it here. Okay, GeoGebra. Okay, let's copy this and let's paste it here. Okay, GeoGebra. And then, let's click ito. Pwedeng ito, pwedeng ito. Pag ito yung kinilik mo, it will give you a fraction. Hindi na alam ko ang itura na. Let's have this one. So, it's 50.06. Labis na ng 0.06 because x equals 1.12 is just an approximation. So, tama yung una natin. Let's have x is approximately equal to 1.86. Let's see whether kung pwede si 1.86. Substitute lang ulit natin. Okay, and then let's copy this. Tapos, ilagay lang ulit natin kay GeoGebra. Tanggalin lang natin yung equal sign. And then, let's have this one. The answer is 49.99, which is 0.01 away from 50. So, that verifies also that 1.86 is also a solution of our problem. Let's go back. What's the question again? We're going to look for the length of the sides of the square to be cut out. So, thus, the length, the length of the square to be cut out is approximately 1.12. What's that? 1.12 centimeters. I think it's centimeters. 1.12 units. Walang nakalagay. 1.12 units or one point approximately one point eighty six units. Okay, and that's it. So therefore the lengths can be one point twelve or one point eighty six units.